Hey YouTube family and friends, how is everything going and how is everybody this beautiful hot, soon to be very very hot day. That's why I'm doing this recording early. I want to um, do it before it gets too hot because it's been into the hundreds and well over the hundreds here lately. Anyways, um, I did a little dumpster diving yesterday so I wanted to do a video. Um, as you can see I'm holding this really nice blanket. I actually found four of these. They're a nice, really pretty pink, a light pink. Yeah, it's something floating on me, sorry. Gotta make sure it's not bugs. Um, it's a hair. Rabbit fake fur throw. Price on these, $19.99. There's four of them. I've already put the other three up in the trailer. There's nothing wrong with them. These are nice, tied with a nice, really pretty bow. And there's nothing wrong with them. So, um, I don't understand why they threw them away. This is from the at home store, but I'm going to show you. Also, as you can see, I'm pulling out this mirror. Nice mirror. There is a little teeny weeny half moon, um, chip, not chip, the glass is still there, but a little half moon crack right here. This has a price tag of $100 on it. And so I'm going to pull it out here and set it up over here out of my way and I'm gonna make sure I try to talk a little bit louder because I know my other videos you can't really hear me so I have to remember that okay just a little story about the at-home store we used to go and look and see and they never had a dumpster they just had a uh, trash compactor well we were dumpster diving in a big dumpster at Michael's about a two weeks ago probably and this girl stopped by and asked us how we were doing if we were finding anything and she said oh by the way I used to work at at home she goes they finally got a dumpster go check it out well we have been finding some really nice stuff the other day last week we found two really nice bar stools that are um, really nice wide bar stools they have material on them one there was nothing wrong with $150 is the price on them the other one at the bottom part of where the material ends there's a little bitty it's not even a tear it's just like it pulled out i'm going to fold that under staple and i'm going to sell those and then we found a really nice high back wing chair with the little tacks that go all the way around it very nice probably about a 400 hundred dollar chair the only thing is the legs thank goodness there's a screw in legs two of the legs are there one was missing and one of the screws on one leg was bent so we're just going to go to like lowe's or something and buy four legs for that and i'll be putting that on marketplace soon but enough of that. So anyways, another thing at Home Goods from this pretty orchid. It doesn't have the um, container, but I'm sure I can find something to put it in. Very pretty. This was $20 with whatever the container was. But obviously that got broken. Um, oh, I found this. Found this really cute. It's a red schnauzer. And I have no idea why. Maybe it just didn't sell. It got marked, it was $12.99, got marked down. Just must not have sold, because obviously, um, if you like Clifford the Red Dog, there you go. Nothing wrong with it. There's also a container of lights in here. I don't know, what is on here? Oh, wax or something. Container of pink lights. 70 pink light incandescent lights. I know the lid's in there somewhere. Oh, I know what it is. It's just elk. The elk has something. Really funny story. I found an elk the other day. Left it there because it was missing one of the antlers. Came home and in one of the boxes I found the antlers. Went back and got the elk. Somehow all of its legs got broken up. So I found another elk. This one's missing, but it's got, um, yeah, it's candle wax or something. But it's an elk. I'm going to find the antlers and see if I can glue them on. Or maybe just break this one off and do something with it. But anyways, there's that. And then found a whole bunch of Swedish, Swedish fish. And there's five, five of the Swedish fish minis, little mini ones of Swedish fish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight bags of the uh, 
greasy peanut butter miniature the little cup and that's another reason why i want to do those these have not started to melt i have a refrigerator in the trailer i'm going to throw them in there when i go in there um got a couple of the trolls this is sour octopus these are twisted sour bright cr um, crawlers My brother's trying to call me. I'm not going to answer right now because I'm doing this. And then I found this cute little thing. I don't know exactly what this is. It's um, a little piece in here is broken. No big deal. Nothing else is broken on it. I guess you could put a little pot or something or plant or something in there. Little uh, tree guy. He's really cute. He is normally $10. And then I have one, two... Three, four, five, seven, eight. Eight of this. Never heard of this. I mean, I I like black jelly beans. I'm not sure if I like black licorice. I guess it's probably pretty much the same. But um, Lucky Country Australian made black licorice. Eight bags of that. And then two bags of the peanut M&M's. Two bags of peanut M&M's. And they're, not so they're getting soft. That's why I got to get them out of there. And then I found this cute little pumpkin. It looks like um, this little thing up top here, you put like a picture in. Nothing wrong with it. So I'm going to put all this stuff back in here. And I'll have to get, get that up into the trailer where I store a lot of my stuff. Obviously, we don't use the trailer for anything right now, but storage of my uh, stuff. So there's that. Okay, what else came from home? Oh, no, I'm going to run around the side and grab this one thing over here. Hold on. I'll show you this. I, the pot would have been really cute had the pot all been together, but it's not. So I'm going to take this out. This is hens and chicks. I'm going to take this out and find a new pot for it. That's another thing we found. And there's one last thing that I found at home this last night. Found this really nice table. This up here it's got a glass top on it. Last night I didn't notice this, but the only thing that is wrong with this is why those are on there. It's coming unweaved a little bit. All I have to do is tuck that back in there, put a little bit of glue in there, and it's an absolutely perfectly fine table. It's got little cork things, little cork stickers, maybe just for when you transport it. but the glass there's nothing wrong with the glass it's a beautiful table it's the, it's the plastic wicker not the real wicker but this had a price tag of $79.99 on it so just between the the mirror at 180 for the 180 and then four at 80 three $260 just for the four blankets a mirror on that table. Absolutely love the dumpster diving it at home. Oh, this is an empty box. I'm going to be able to use this while I'm showing you some other stuff. I'm going to try to quit turning my back because I know I end up not, you end up not being able to hear me. Okay, so I went to uh, TJ Maxx yesterday too. I found this um, electric face cleansing brush. It is waterproof. Not sure if it works or not. But there is that. This was a, oh shoot, this got broke. Well, maybe it was broke. Anyways, there was this really cute box at TJ Maxx. Um, I can uh, fix that lid. It almost feels like wallpaper is what it's wall done with. I can, I can give that a little fix with no problem. I found a box of K-Cups. Kona Breeze blend, and then these two cute little uh, Play-Doh bunny and chick stampers. These are really cute. Still getting rid of Easter stuff. I'm going to keep a lot of the Easter stuff in that separate because, and I don't know what this is a puzzle of, because it wasn't in a box or anything, but it's a puzzle. The bag's not open, so I'm assuming 
everything's there. And then, I don't know if this was lost and found or what, but there was a bunch of old like phones, like flip phones and that. But I also found this LG, I'm not sure if this is a, yep, it's a G-Pad 70. Haven't tried to turn it on yet or anything, but I'm gonna take that in the house with me and see if that'll, if I can get it charged and see if that's working. And then, um, this must have been a tester. Gardener's Hand Repair Protective Conditioner Shea Butter Oatmeal. Um, it was probably like their tester because it's only like half full. Smells really good. Ooh, that smells really good. Okay. So that was what I got from TJ Maxx. Then we went to Michael's. Oh my gosh, another good Michael's haul out of the great big huge dumpster. It was emptied. Went there once. There was nothing. Went there again. Didn't find anything. And then went there yesterday and it was packed. And I was out. It had to be 100 degrees when I was dumpster diving that. I had to go sit in the car a couple different times to cool off because it was absolutely terrible. I'm looking at, sorry, I'm looking at this. My flat, okay. I'm hoping it's not going to keep shutting off on me like it did before. I did erase a lot of stuff out of there. Anyways, Michael. Cute lantern, $34.99. There is one piece of broken glass which can be replaced. Other than that, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Just the glass. Um, oh, I guess I did find I did find something else at um, TJ or at Marshall. Sorry, I found a candle, and that's a thing of this bath gel or something, and it's leaking everywhere. So I'm gonna get rid of that. But the candle, obviously, oh, it smells really good. It is a oh, raw honey and. Neroli? I don't know what that is. N-E-R-O-L-I. If anybody knows what that is, let me know. But I found that, but the, the um, gel's got to go because it's going to be all over. And I found this cute little metal fan. I'm hoping that when we plug it in, I just got to clean it off. Something was dumped on it. Some kind of powdery stuff. I don't know what was dumped on it. And um, so there is that. But this is a cute little fan. It's all metal. I absolutely love metal fans, so I'm hoping this works. So that was that was the end of the Marshall stuff. Now, from as for Michaels, there's this uh, fabric spray paint, fabric spray paint, and it is black. I'm assuming um, this cute little bucket of slimy goop, slimy sand, and it looks like on top there might have been like little cookie cutters. Or like little cutters or you could take this I guess push it into this stuff and make that let's see what it said did it come with three colors there's oh purple yeah there's purple pink and a teal color in here three different colors and stretches and expands easy to clean doesn't say anything about oh three molds yeah well it's probably just push the lid down on it so there is that I'm gonna try to make this quick of stuff. Um, I was pulling stuff out. I don't even know half of what's in here. This is some glitter and sequins glue. I found a few of these. This is a compact mirror. I think there's like three or four of them in there. Kind of shiny. Got little pearls on it. This is um, Happy New Year um, tape for scrapbooking. And this is, let's see, there we go. Other things may change, but we start and end with family. Nothing wrong with this. Really cute. This was like a $16 little dealie that you hang on your wall. Now, see, half the stuff I just kept throwing in there, and I have not looked at this, so I don't even know what I got. Oh, pool noodle. It's a pool noodle. It looks like, I don't know, it's over five feet tall. It's a pool, no pool noodle. So, there is that. And then, oh, I got a couple more of these Easter um, face things. They, they're suckers, little suckers. These are, oh, hey, oh, that's cute. My daughter's, my daughter, it's pink, and it starts with, it got an A on it. My daughter's name is April, so I will add that to her pile of stuff. Just cute little um, notepads. These are polka dots, and then ones with, uh, with the, 
either if she doesn't want them, then my daughter-in-law, her name is Ashley. So I can give them to either one of them. So I'm going to put that with my stuff. Um, another skein of yarn, which if you saw my last video from Michael's, I got a tons of yarn. I did get some more, not as much, but this will all be going to my cousin and my aunt back in Michigan. Um, brush markers, portrait tones. So package of brush markers, I'm sure those can't be cheap. That My daughter wants those because she does do a lot of art and stuff. Oh, this is really cute. It's just a keychain with fuzzies. This will also be really cute for the new kitten we got. And I will show you the kitten. If you guys see this, my, my kitten does have a Facebook page because she is blind. And we, have, we found out she was blind when we found her. Somebody found her in the middle of the road, brought her over here to see if it was our cat. It wasn't, but we decided to take her. We were going to um, give her to a uh, um, rescue, but we decided to keep her. This is a Mickey Mouse thing, but as you can see on the back, the crayons have all melted. So I'm just going to throw that away. I'm not going to deal with that. There is a tin. I did find the lid. Here it is. Whether it matches or not, I don't know. But it fits on there, so I've got a tin. No, it does not match. But, hey, it's a tin with the lid. I did find a ton more Christmas cupcake holders. I didn't take all of them. There was a bunch, but I did take quite a bit. These are glitter mixing tubes. This is a really cute picture frame. I love this. You are my sunshine. Oh my God. It's got a magnet. Magnet back there and a magnet back there. So you put a picture on it. Nothing wrong with this. This sold for $20. Isn't this adorable? You are my sunshine. Definitely putting a picture of my Remy Joe in there. And I'm going to keep that for myself. Another thing, a glitter making tubes. Here is Mermaid's Activity Book. That's really cute. Mermaid Activity Book. This is a thing of extreme slime glitter. It's not open. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, now see, here is another one of those Mickey Mouse play packs. Grab and glow. It's four crayons, one sheet of stickers, and a 24-page fun size coloring book. This packet of crayons, nothing wrong with it. So we will be keeping that one. A thing of melt. It is ocean air. Didn't know you could uh, uh, make ocean air smell like ocean air. But anyways, these are paint pen paint pens. Looks like they are, I don't know what color, but anyways, a package of paint pens. This is a package of chalk. Nothing wrong with that. Another one of those compacts that makes two. I found a bunch of these little ones. I thought these were really cute. These are glitter strips. Trim. Glitter strips. If you did scrapbooking, these would really be cute. You could put them in your scrapbook, which I do. So that's probably going to be something I'm going to keep. Um, here is a set of lights. Yeah, it looks like a set of lights. And it's got hangers and hooks and what have you. But a set of lights. Is it lights? I don't know what it is. It just says... Oh no, it's a 15 foot light cord. It's a cord, it's not light. It's just a cord. All right, there's that. And then I found this big thing of, I think these are beads. Value pack beads. My niece back home does make break bracelets. I don't know if she'd be interested in these or not. I'm gonna keep them out and see if she might be interested in those. Oh, April will probably like this. It's a six packs of plastic welt palettes. That's put your colors in there. She does paint, she might might like those and I think I found a couple of those another thing <coughs> another thing Merry Christmas Happy New Year cupcake holders these I found a bunch of so you'll be seeing more this says Happy Va or, or Valentine's Day it's a little garland as you can see up there Valentine's Day garland and I did did find a whole bunch of those um, I think I might have taken the little uh, thingies that go with this or the uh, this is for a latch hook kit I have no clue, but I think I've got the the um, yarn pieces that go with it. This is just a little doily, a little pink doily, like your grandma used to uh, knit or crochet. And this is some flower, the, the waterproof flower tape. I think I also found a thing of wire in there, some broken stuff. I'll just set down here on the ground for right now. 
And this box, um, really cute box. They did a little bit of paint, get that off, but it's got chalkboard. The bottom is coming out a little bit, but I can push that back in there and a little bit of glue or whatever. It'll be fine. It's a cute little box with the with the handles on it. I'm not going to put anything in there right now because I don't want that to break further. So on we go. There's the yarn. I'm going to keep that off to the side. Oh, we did also went to Harbor, Harbor Freight the other day. I found a wheel for I made a tire. A tire with a hub on it. Never know. Some of you might need one tire. <laughs> oh, and I also found these. This is a Harbor Freight. I'm not sure if it's all here. But this is a universal rooftop crossbar set. Um, it's a crossbar that they go on your roof of your car or truck or whatever. And the other one is right here. It was out of the box. I don't know what's wrong with it. We'll have to take a look and see. But I did find that. I'm just kind of set that off to the side there. We'll get a good grip on that. Okay, no, I did not find the air conditioning unit in a dumpster. We went and bought that yesterday because ours is taking a big pip This is more stuff I found at um, Michael's. Some more cupcake holders. Some Strip Lock Pro stuff for your, I believe this is probably for your Cricut. And this will go back to Michigan with me. Um, Colton's... Uh, Wife Katie has a uh, cricket machine. If this is, I believe that's what this is for, but they, when they cut the box, they probably cut into this and the top layer is cut or they purposely cut it. I don't know either or. Some more of this really pretty chenille yarn. Another thing, a gray yarn. This is a unscented candle, which I don't know why you'd want unscented candles, but anyways, another thing, a cupcake holders. This is a full thing of gold glitter. My ex-husband absolutely loves glitter. Not. This is a, looks like one yard of red cotton material. A little package of magic markers. Here is some more of the Valentine's. This one says Valentine's Day, same thing. Now, these are two wooden things. I did find some graduation stuff. These are two wooden things that spell out senior. And I guess if you wanted to, you could paint them. It doesn't have anything. It just says senior. Two of these packages for senior. Most of the other stuff I found for the seniors um, was not dated. This is stencil tape. Oh, I guess to hold your stencil down. So this is a little package of stencil tape. I found a bunch of these, and I don't know what these are. Oh, treat bags. 18-piece treat bags. A bunch of really cute ones. Christmas trees, plaid, black and white, again plaid, um, treat bags or boxes? You say treat bags. Oh, these are like different colors. Each one's different. It's got different, two different patterns in them. It might be, they look like bags on the front and boxes. Oh, contains, oh, 18 treat bags and 18 header cards. Okay, so that's the, another pin and, uh, Oh, and inside is a, another, and I, these do, I guess, so that does go together. That's the pattern that goes with these ones. So, I've got those, another, another set of tins. This one's a little dented, it needs to be undented. And then I found a couple of these, some of them are thrown way up there, I'm not going to grab them, but these are 12 days of craft kits. So, 12 days of Christmas cards. Look, it says fabric, I'm not sure if they're fabric or what they are, but anyways, Christmas cards to make. Um, oh, more of the, more of the bags. Three more packages of bags. One, two, three, four more of the Valentine's Day um, felt banners. This, I just grabbed this. The bottom piece is broke off. I guess maybe you could uh, cut it off here. A little stain on it and you'd have one less cute little I guess maybe you set it on a table and put stuff in it I have no idea what you do with it anybody can do whatever they would want to do with it that is garbage garbage this is a little set I picked this up not sure what it is 
Oh, it's a little school set. It has a little, um, I forgot what these things are called. Pro is, that a, is that a protractor? I don't remember. It's missing some stuff. It's got a little pencil, a little ruler, and a sharpener. I don't know what else is in there, what would have gone in there, but part of it's there. Somebody might want it. Okay. This will be my garbage box. What is that? Oh. Oh, I missed this. Oh, it's a little kitty banner. You put her on your little kitty's neck. Isn't that cute? That's adorable. All right. If your cat would even tolerate wearing that, I have no idea if it would or not. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Another pet, a thing in those treat bags with cards. A Zen Doodle Colorscape coloring book, which I like to do. Color, I don't know if I want this book, but another adult coloring book. Whew, a thing of orange ribbon. Okay, here's the grad stuff. This says, the world is calling and I must go. I guess it's to look like a uh, cap and a tassel. I guess you put your tassel in there. Adventure is out there. Big city is waiting. Adventure is out there. Adventure is out there. Adventure is out there. Big city waiting. So these are all for, for grads. Oh, this is really cute. I guess I need to get a, take this one off, get a little paper clip, or I'm in a little, um, not paper clip, um, clothespin, put that on there, and you can hang a picture on there. That's really cute. Oh, here's that, um, yarn for that, um, latch hook kit. <laughs> this is really cute. Look at, it's a little nest. Can't believe they charge six dollars for this. It's a little nest with some eggs in it. Six dollars for that. I don't think so, Michaels. A broken stick. See, I was grabbing stuff, just grabbing, grabbing. Um, this was actually an eight-piece crochet hook, which there is four crochet hooks left. So I'll put that with the yarn. This is this is for Cricut, and it's a coaster set compatible with infusible ink ceramic coaster set. I don't know. I don't know anything about the Cricut. But this is a G, a wooden G. My brother's name is Greg. Maybe he wants it. Okay, this is a necklace activity trolls world tour. Contains one charm, one necklace, and 30 bees. Okay, I guess you make your own cute little troll necklace. <laughs> this is a two and a half inch brush for applying safety back to latch hook rugs. Really? Okay. Don't know anything about that. Oh, uh, three-piece pen set, a little mechanical uh, pencil set, a little mechanical pencil set there. One, two, three. Oh, I got some more bees. Three more packages of bees with the cards. Two more things of cupcake holders. Up today. Play a set of place cards. I'm doing a video. I'm doing a YouTube video. And another thing of the um, glitter, well, not really glittery, but this one's red. Anyways, it says it's trim. I would use it in scrapbooking. These are a set of place cards by uh, Martha Stewart. These are for, it says graduation. I guess this one's empty. Yep, that's empty. These one, this is what was in that one. Grab. Congratulations, grab. These are uh, paper straws, black and white, with little um, things that, on there that says grad on it. These are a couple of things. It says work wanted. I guess you could use these. They're stickers. You could use them scrapbooking if you were doing a grad scrapbook. Another thing of grad, or a thing of grad cupcake holders. This is cards and envelopes, a full pack, 15 sets of cards and envelopes, just plain blue. Oh, what is this? Oh, mermaid. Mermaid amazing. Oh, isn't that cute? Just a little mermaid book. Um, notebook. A cute little wooden birdhouse kit. 
this has color butterfly kit. This says it's a butterfly kit. Sorry, what birds wouldn't fit in there with a butterfly kit. And the paints are in there and everything. Nothing wrong with it. It's not broken at all. This is genuine leather for cricket. It's a piece of leather for cricket. So I guess that's going to go to Katie too because I know she has a cricket. I found this. I wish I would have found more of these. These are really cute. I love these things. It looks like a little vinaigrette with the cork in it. Nothing wrong with it. There was some broken ones, I think, in there. A thing of... I don't know. Cording. It says cording. Multicolor. Little spool of cording. Nothing wrong with that. A thing of pins. Oh, these are these are corsage pins. Those are really cute. They've got a little, uh, I don't know if you see the tip on them, but a little cute uh, crystal tip on them. Not tip, but the end. Here is a spool of, well, it says ribbon. You know, obviously, it's not ribbon. It's like a uh, cording. Two more of those compacts. Really cute pearl compacts. Trying to get these beads without them spilling out, so hang on one second. There we go. I have a niece who does beading, makes bracelets, and I'm going to be going back to Michigan in August for a baby shower, and I'm going to drive, and I'm going to take all this yarn, and I'm going to take these beads back to her. I found a pack just like this in yellow, and now I have this black pack. So, Carly, if you're watching this, these are for you. And then there is one, two, three, four, five packages of Congrats Glad, Grad Cupcake thingies. And then this, probably, unless you have the grad and want to do a scrapbook class of 2020, which I feel so bad for those kids. And a paintbrush. And then this... I don't believe this goes in here, so we'll try to wiggle this out of here and see what this is about. I know this doesn't go in here. No, nope, these both got different price tags. Okay, dope. Isn't this cute? This is adorable. It is metal, and it says miscellaneous, and this sold for $30. Isn't that cute? It's a metal basket. Nothing wrong with it at all. Absolutely nothing wrong with it cute little metal basket and then I have and they did spray paint these so I could spray paint the whole basket Michaels normally doesn't do this but I could spray paint these are $40 baskets and I found two of these there's nothing wrong with them except for them spray painting it but I guess I could spray paint the whole basket so I have two of those isn't it cute 